should be able to reach the altar this way. No quarrel with you, boy. Join me. 
I can secure us away from the King and the Oracle. How do I know I can trust you? Have you any other options? You have a point. Then it's settled. We must be quick. be of use after all. Follow me, if you're ready. Magitek armor. Indeed. You needn't waste your time. I've ordered a full retreat. They'll be gone soon enough. Very well. Why turn against the Empire? Why now? My sister's life is at stake. Is that not reason enough? Oh. The paths we tread may differ, but the blood coursing through our veins is one. So too is our calling. I must protect her. What of it? I have doubts that you were born with a prosthetic. Your doubts are correct. I once believed it was I who was destined to dispel the darkness. This is proof I was wrong. Is it safe to assume this means you'll lend Nocta hand? Don't be asinine. Our interests may have aligned in this moment, but I have not allied myself with him. The Empire is after the Ring of the Luci. If the Ring falls into the wrong hands, I fear there's little hope for either of them. Then we must hurry! haven't much time. I'm aware. Tread quietly. I know. Keep up. Right.
Ready? You have to ask. Let's make this quick. Gladly. Don't get in my way, so long as you stay out of mine. Tell me, do you truly believe Noctis is the one true king? I believe it goes without saying. Yet when the flames of war enshrouded Tenebrae, his father spared us nary a second thought. No savior king could possibly be born of such cowardice. <sighs> to aid the king is the Oracle's calling, is it not? Or have you simply forgotten the pledge sworn by your forebears? I have not forgotten, nor have I forgiven. I'm tired of this. Let's end it. I got you now. Yeah. Oh. Well enough. You're resilient, I'll give you that. If Noctis is the true king, he still has much to prove. The darkness will not wait for his ascent. It will consume our star, and all upon it. I know. He may not yet grasp the gravity of his calling, but once he does, he will rise to the occasion and fulfill his destiny. One can only hope you're right. Luna Freya. Hmm? Are you her dog? A power greater than even that of the Six, purifying all by the light of the crystal and the glaives of rulers past. Chosen receive it, and only at the cost of a life, his own. The King of Kings shall be granted the power to banish the darkness, but the blood price must be paid. 
To cast out the usurper and usher in dawn's light will cost the life of the chosen. Many sacrificed all for the king, so must the king sacrifice himself for all. Now enter into reflection, let the light of providence shine within. <sighs> What did I just see? A vision of what's to come? Stole from me my mother. And now they make a sacrifice of my sister. Get out of my way. What are you doing? What I should have done long ago. Ridding us of this menace. You too shall be the same fate! Come to your senses, man! I understand the pain you must be feeling. But Noct isn't the one who did this to her. Oh, yes. Yes! came to her king's aid in this time of need. She was fulfilling her call. Don't try to justify this! She didn't need to die! Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Take this! Kill him, and her sacrifice will have been for naught! Kill him, and you kill her hopes for the future! What hope is there in a future that my sister will never see? Her beside yeah. you, all thou guts my Noct didn't choose to become king. His ascension was ordained by the crystal. It wasn't mere happenstance. It was a mistake, one that must be corrected. You, of all people, must understand how Noct feels. Bereft of both parents, forced to carry on despite losing those you love. You both feel that pain. I feel nothing. Pathetic. It's over! Yeah. Too late. Suffer! Death to Noctis and his men! Your mind! Fall to my blade!
I always knew. That you would face your fate without fear. Fulfill your duty without regret. But part of me always hoped that I might see you happy one day. Your burdens lifted, free to live and love as you please. You would have made a beautiful bride. Even in death, the Oracle does not rest. Only once the darkness is dispelled is her calling truly fulfilled. And as in life, I know she will confront that challenge with a smile on her face. Oh, sister, please don't go. Please don't leave me. Biggie! Gladio! Are you all right? Where's Prompto? Well, well. What have we here? <laughs> you... Arden. Oh dear. Was I that transparent? The game's up, my boy. Follow your leisure's lead and stop resisting. Uh, never! You risked life and limb to safeguard the King of Kings, only to witness him fail so. <laughs> you must be so disappointed. Unhand him! I know I am. Oh, what good is a world that only ever lets you down? Why not end it all right here? No. You can't. <laughs> No! My, you two certainly have become fast friends. Rather than follow this flotsam and float away to a watery grave, why not come with me? What do you say? I... I... Yeah! <laughs> 
Take that as a no. I swore an oath to stand with Noct and keep him safe. Whatever it takes, I will protect him. I wouldn't do that if I were you. I may not be of royal blood, but if a glaive can harness its power, then so can I! Kings of Lucis, lend me your strength! Well, they've shown you their favor after all. Well, if you're so keen on keeping you safe, I'd like to see you try. Uh, whoa! Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> no time to waste now. If you're not quick about it. You're the one liable to wind up dead. Here! Whoa! <laughs> How lucky to be surrounded by such skilled advisors. What a thing to to show them tough. Why not cease this futile show-off? Your appeals to hope and loyalty will all come to naught in the end. No! You're wrong. You're mine! Phew, wasn't that exhilarating? I think that's enough for one day. That was rather reckless. Mm. Mm. Where is Noct? Is he... Is he... All right? More or less. All thanks to you. Thank goodness. <coughs> Serve your strength. You have a calling to fulfill. Not Iggy! As do I. May fortune favor us both. And you as well, Noctis.
How are you feeling? It might be best if we brought our journey to a close. Why? It's just that um, we've already lost so much. Too much. Are you kidding me? That's exactly why I have to keep going. Because if I give up now, their sacrifices would have been for nothing. And you. You of all people. You should know that better than anyone. <sighs> the decision is yours to make, and yours alone. But do remember, we will stand with you always, and help you bear your burdens. Don't be afraid to let us share the load. I'll be back. You know, looking back, it wasn't all bad. I suppose we had some fun along the way. And our fair share of trouble, too. But I don't have any regrets. Luna and you guys brought me this far. And now, I'm on my own. Uh, no, you won't be going alone. I'll... No, you're right. I mean... I wouldn't have made it all this way without you guys. Why stop now? In the end, I might not have you at my side, but I'll always have you in my heart. Thanks. Thanks for everything, Iggy. <laughs> 